Hey, welcome back to my channel, Ayana Supreme, where I do lock tutorials as well as wig reviews. And it's been some time, so hey guys, I really miss you, okay? This is my celebration dance of returning back to YouTube where I'm finally interfacing. And I have a whole new bunch of subscribers, so thank you so much. Um, this review is from the company Lolly Hair. I'm sure you've seen a whole bunch of their ads on Instagram and I was like, let me give it a chance, okay? I saw a little sale, you know, I like sales and everything like that. It is human hair. I wanted to try something different. Not that I've never done it before, but just, you know, something else. Um, this is 20 inches. The next couple wigs that I have gotten actually like back in March or like maybe February um, are 20 inches so they're super short okay short this is the interior of the wig um, some stats on this particular unit it is a highlighted wig meaning it has like highlighted colors and everything like that um, this like amber brown a little bit of blonde um, it's not dark at all, so it can be like a nice spring unit or a nice, um, summer unit as well. There goes the ebon spray for the tint spray. Um, aside from that, it is a 4x4 glueless deep wave closure. So currently right now on the website, it is $75.99. I will include all the details below in the description bar. So I just thought I'd give her a little chance. Um, you know, obviously when you have a human hair unit, you are able to play around with it a little bit more. You can obviously wash, condition, and everything like that. Um, but I just wanted to get straight into it. So here is the closure. I am going to cut that off. And I noticed that when they dyed this unit, they didn't evenly dye it. And even the model that you're like observing on the website her hair is dyed it looks more like in splotches so it's not like a consistent looking color all throughout it's just pretty random in terms of the highlighting and stuff like that here is the jagged edge scissor that i'm using to cut off that closure piece i did not use glue and it's not meant necessarily to have glue but clearly you can if you're interested in uh, a little bit more length longevity in terms of like keeping it on for a little while um and so there's that four by four piece of course there's the strap in the back where you can adjust it accordingly to the size of your head i have a lot of hair um you know underneath the wig so i am going to give myself as much room as humanly possible because you know obviously i do have medium length to long length locks so I need as much space as humanly possible so this is how it looks on and as I said before in the beginning of this video it's super short so it wasn't what I was envisioning for whatever reason I didn't think 20 inches was as short as it actually is because I feel like my hair itself is probably a little bit longer and I haven't measured my hair or anything like that but I just assumed that my hair was shorter than 20 inches um so yeah so it's it's a it, for me it's a short unit um and at the way that it falls on my body is pretty short as well so i think that i would have loved this unit a lot more had it been a lot longer um you know i want va 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 boom you know what i mean but an alternative that i came up with was well since it is human hair and it has this like texture to it why don't I play around and see if it would look cute with like a bump and like a curl and like flat iron and stuff like that but anyway I am just adding some tinted moisturizer to the part to make it look like you know it's like scalp or whatever even though like <sighs> it does a better job than like concealer for me for whatever reason um, so I just use a tinted moisturizer and it looks a little bit more realistic that way. The wig does really great with heat, which is fantastic. However, 
the higher that I turned the heat, it did, it did get like that like smoky smell throughout the house. Like, so you just want to be careful of that. Even though there was a smoky smell, the wig did not burn, thankfully. But, you know, just be mindful of that. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and find my other pages. Okay? So you can see how the color is not like consistent all throughout the wig. It just looks like they just put some dye in certain areas towards the front and you know replicated that several times because as I said before the model that um, I purchased the hair from I guess you could say like the, the image of what I saw was very much the same as this one. Um, but I guess I didn't really like look at it too too hard. Uh, in order to notice the uh, the coloring and how it was placed um, it's more visible while it's straight obviously um, you know so I tried to give it like a bump but the hair kind of didn't bump 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 you know what I mean not too much B2K um, in order to give this unit like a full rating um, zero to ten I would give this unit a strong seven um I deducted points for length it's not as long as I envisioned um, and that's my mistake um, the other issue that I have is like the inconsistence of the coloring kind of threw me off um, but I do like the color in general because I think it's super flattering on my complexion. Um, and I was I wish it was a bit more ready to go in terms of like the scalp parting was a little bit more plucked and stuff like that. Because as I say before, and I say this all the time, I want to do as little as humanly possible. But I guess you can't do that with a hundred bucks. <laughs> and that's a lesson learned. So yeah, there she is. It's not too terrible. I think it looks great with a brown lip. Um, and it has a, a texture. It can be curly. It can be um, blown out, flat ironed, and what have you. And yeah, so I think a 7 out of 10 is pretty reasonable. So I would like to say thank you for making this far in the video. And please write in the comment section below the color neon purple, okay? So that I know you're really watching this video in its entirety. It's very important for me, and I really appreciate it for you to make it this far. Um, so this is my overall review of the wig. It is a 7 out of 10. She's okay. And don't hesitate to watch my other reviews. I've created playlists um, on my channel. So definitely check out those other channels and find me on Instagram and TikTok and Facebook. Okay, see you in the next video. Bye.